Hello, Matilda. Mm -hmm. Hello, John. You look ravishing in that silk robe. Mm -hmm. John, your mouth looks red and juicy, like a red delicious apple. I just want you to put your mouth on my penis and suck it, suck it hard. I hate porn and being on top. But first things first, I hate porn. I hate it even though I watch it more often than I should. But I hate porn. And not because women are objectified, degraded, and coerced. It is because there's no romance to it. There's no sensuality. There isn't any slow foreplay there's not enough foreplay like the men seriously they go from a to z negative z one million in like in two minutes and you're just like oh, wh wh wait i mean as i as a woman anyway i need a little bit more sensuality here please help me out xvideos.com it's I just, and I hate it, but I have to watch it. So I'm like constantly, like this is what I do before I masturbate. Like I'm literally scrolling through porn videos for a good 20, 25 minutes, feeling a little something before, but not because it's just like, uh, uh, oh gosh. Oh, there, that looks like rape. Oh goodness. That is kind of getting crazy. Like, oh, she looks like she's three. Great. You know, and then it just like kind of takes you just down. I'm like, and then I'm like beating myself up. Like, why am I watching this swill? I mean, okay, I like the occasional bondage kidnapping kind of weird ogre old man porn videos. But I mean, why can't they be a bit more like, I'm going to blindfold you right now, slowly and gently. And then I'm going to tie your hands above your arms and put your arms above your head and slowly caress my hands up your arms. You know, just like make it more sensual and more like, oh, do that at least for 15 minutes before and then like go into your thing. And so I can get something out of this thing. Like I literally have to like watch little clips here and there and it's just like, Gah! and I can't find anything that's like, oh, thank you for just like. 10 minutes of wonderfulness. But yeah, I just, I hate, I hate, 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 hate porn for that reason. It's just so violent and it's so like, like, you're like, Aah! anyway. And <laughs> speaking of, like, I, the CEO or being on top, I struggle. Like, okay, so. This is called Mary Exposed, so exposing myself here. So the other day, I was with a friend who I've known for quite some time, and we had some wine, blah, blah, and I was having such a hard day, and we went up to his room, blah, blah, blah. So we're, um, you know, making out and doing a, a lot of adult things. It gets to the point where we're starting to have sex, and then all of a sudden, I'm like, oh, I'm enjoying you, like you know, being, I'm enjoying this floor play, I'm enjoying you, you know, touching me, blah, blah, and then all of a sudden he's like, oh, oh, I want you to get on top, and I'm like, on top of you? Like, I was like, wait, and he's like, yes, and I was just like thinking, freaking out, because I'm like, I don't like this, I don't want to do that, and then I was just like, so like, I'm done with it, because A, I'm not good on top, I am awful on top, I can't, I don't, A, I don't, I will be, I don't feel anything when I'm on top, so that's like a huge reason why I don't really like being on top. And then C, I just feel like it's just so awkward and I'm staring at them in their face and they look horribly disappointed, like, you really don't know what you're doing. And I thought, because I'm a really good dancer, but like I thought being a good dancer would mean I'd be really good on top. No, not the case. Unless I've had a, a half a bottle of vodka, then I'm like, whatever, everything is... I, I'm wonderful in bed, but like when I'm just like being myself, it's just awful. I'm just like up there and I'm just staring at this person. I'm just like, you're not, you don't like any of this. I know what I miss in bed. Why'd you ask me to do this? And I'm like so in my head. And then like the sex is ruined for me, him, everybody in the room, everybody, everything. So I hate being on top. And you know, I've read like little like 
little um little comments here and there like about how to do it and position yourself and move and maybe you can like feel more comfortable and get in your head and like get yourself in a, like no none of that stuff works I've tried it all and it's just not and I thought I had nailed down you know watching my horns of course like this position there was a certain position I'm like oh okay I can probably do that but then my legs start hurting after 10 15 seconds and I'm like how do these these ladies do this for like 10 minutes and then it's just and then I'm looking at them and then they look like you know what the hell are you doing kind of thing and so yeah I'm just so bad about uh, being a CEO I don't want to be a CEO I want to be whatever's below a CEO I would like to be a CFO or just maybe a regular staff employee that just kind of just you know just coast there just like they're just content with his 775 per hour job you know I'm fine in the sex department I'm fine with that I'm great that's my element my sex element is not CEO I am the basement person I am the mail pusher I deliver your mail I deliver your coffee I wipe your windows I say well, hey sir uh, is there anything more I can do before I uh, head out that's me in bed not I'm making the decisions, I'm telling you this is gonna happen, blah blah blah. That's not me in bed. Because if that was me, I'd be I'm making the bed. <laughs> Which is what I look like when I'm on top of something good. So anyway, please tell me if being on top is hard for you. Because it's hard it's it's work and I can't do it. That's not the work I was put on this earth for. I was well just supposed to just lay there like uh, and take it and do other things that I'm good at not being on top okay just I, I don't want to do it anymore so please tell me if you struggle with being a CEO in bed I want to know and what and if you've remedied remedied it or if you still just suck and just say hey you know what when you ask me to get on top I'm probably just gonna do other things to distract you so I don't actually have to get on top which is where I'm at now so if anyone ever asks me to get on top I'm just gonna have to do something distracting like you know, make it, maybe a donkey does like, hee haw, hee haw, where he's like, what the fuck? I'm like, <laughs> and thank you so much for watching, we're exposed. Please comment below. Let me know how you get over these things.